Yup, been taking one plant supplement every day with a meal for years now. 100% improves acne. What's up guys, my name is Brian Turner and I've dealt with extremely severe cystic acne, which is why I share what I've learned so that you can get rid of yours faster. Today, I'm gonna be sharing a few vitamins and minerals that have been proven in studies to help eliminate acne. Now I can safely say, I guarantee that this is gonna be the most valuable video you watch all week, but honestly, if you have acne, then possibly your entire life. Now, without further ado, let's just get into this. Now, I put a ton of work into researching all of these as I was creating my acne program, theacnemethod.com, which has been able to effectively help hundreds of people completely get rid of their acne. So I'm gonna be reading a lot of this directly from the vitamin section of the Acne Secrets book, which you can get in the bundle. So let's start with this very first one. All right, now we're starting this off with zinc. This is an essential mineral found commonly in foods like seeds and nuts, beans, whole grains. It contributes to a lot of different functions in the body. Now, this is actually a crazy statistic. 12 to 40% of the USA is deficient in zinc depending on what age group you're looking at. In a study, they supplemented half of 332 patients with 30 milligrams of elemental zinc each day for 90 days, and they found that 31.2% of them saw an improvement in their acne. Now, something else to keep in mind though is that for some people who are deficient in zinc, their natural testosterone production is lower than it should be. And then when they start supplementing zinc, that testosterone level rises and that can cause acne. It's not super common, but keep a close eye on whether having more zinc increases or decreases your acne. I've talked about this on my channel before and the majority of people commenting said that they noticed an improvement though. Okay, next up, number two is vitamin E. In a 2014 study, they found that patients with severe to very severe acne had low levels of vitamin A, zinc, and vitamin E compared to those who did not have severe acne. Vitamin E can be found in foods like nuts, seeds, leafy vegetables, oils. It can also be found in supplemental form as well as being used in topical moisturizers and different skincare products, usually in the form of tosopherol. Vitamin E deficiency is more rare because it is found in a lot of different foods, but that doesn't mean that you are guaranteed to be good. I have a tip that I will share at the end of this video to easily check if you're deficient in any of these vitamins or minerals that I mentioned. And that brings us to number three, which is vitamin A. This is probably the vitamin that we've all heard about the most when it comes to acne because of Accutane, which is a derivative of vitamin A. The vitamin A that you get in a prescription like Accutane is different than the vitamin A that you just get off the shelf at a supplement store. So you really shouldn't attempt to use over-the-counter vitamin A in the same way to clear your acne. And by that, I, I mean don't mega dose store-bought vitamin A, just like you would with Accutane, because it is very dangerous and it requires monthly blood work to make sure that you are healthy. What is great though, is that just like in the last study, we've seen that people who are deficient in vitamin A tend to have more acne. So eating foods that have vitamin A or supplementing vitamin A so that you hit your RDA, which is your required daily allowance, can help to clear your acne. A lot of foods have vitamin A, but some foods that are really high in it are carrots, sweet potatoes, broccoli, spinach, bell peppers. There's a whole bunch more. Number four, vitamin B3, specifically nicotinamide. In an article review in 2006, they found a large study Study that shows vitamin B3 can effectively eliminate acne. Here's what the article said. During the past 50 years, many clinical reports have identified nicotinamide as a beneficial agent in the treatment of a variety of inflammatory skin disorders. Now with this one, it's really important to note that vitamin B3 comes in two different forms, which is niacin, that's the more common one, and then nicotinamide, which is what we're talking about. Both are vitamin B3, but the one that's shown in studies to help improve acne is this one, nicotinamide. Overall, the B complex of vitamins have gotten a ton of attention in the acne community community lately, and lots of people have seen improvements when using them. And also something that's cool is that both topical and oral use have been reported to improve acne. Something important to note is that most of the foods where you can get vitamin B3 actually have the niacin form of B3, so it may just be easier to supplement this one. Okay, next up, this one is extremely important, and it's vitamin 
D. Okay, so just think of three of your friends, right? Out of the four of you, two of you are for sure deficient in vitamin D, and that's because 50% of the United States is deficient. That is insane. Now, this is really bad news because being deficient in vitamin D can definitely cause acne. In one study of 80 acne patients in 2016, they found that supplementing vitamin D helped improve acne, and listen to this crazy quote, deficiency in vitamin D was detected in 48.8% of patients with acne. That's crazy. Half of the people who had acne were also deficient in vitamin D. Imagine if everybody who had acne just started trying to supplement a little bit of vitamin D. So listen to this other crazy part in that study. In a subsequent trial, improvement in inflammatory lesions was noted after supplementation with vitamin D in 39 acne patients with vitamin D deficiency. This right here, learning this, this is one of those things that you learn in a video that's worth its weight in gold and you guys just got it for free. So definitely let me know how this one goes for you. Now next up is one that a lot of people don't even know exist and this is selenium. This is a mineral that we can get from nuts and seeds like Brazil nuts and it's crazy. In a study in 1990 they found that there was a lower level of selenium in the blood of those who suffered from acne. Now if you're like me you have absolutely no idea what selenium is until a couple years years ago is when I learned about it. But look at what this other study from 2008 says. Low levels of blood selenium have been documented in acne patients and one study examined the effect of selenium and vitamin E daily for 12 weeks in acne. The combination led to improvements. So this is yet another piece of evidence that backs up that not only selenium but also vitamin E help to improve acne. Now next on the list is vitamin B5, pantothenic acid. You've probably heard of B5 because there are a ton of viral videos about people pretty much eliminating their acne after using it. And in a study from 2014, they tested 41 subjects with B5 supplementation for 12 weeks and they saw improvements in their acne lesions. Now on the contrary, there are reviews from users on the internet claiming that they experienced things like hair loss and other side effects when supplementing B5. So in terms of how to dose it, you're gonna find all sorts of different protocols on the internet. Some have very high doses, so I definitely recommend talking with your doctor before you start taking any B5. So what we're learning from this video is that vitamin and mineral deficiencies can be the cause of acne and addressing that can fully eliminate acne for some people, which is nuts, right? And it's important to know that you can get vitamins and minerals from your food or you can supplement them. And earlier I talked about how you could check to see if you were deficient in things. And this is the tip, ready? Use chronometer.com to log the food that you eat for a whole day so you can see what vitamins and minerals you're receiving from the meals you eat and then this can help you address any deficiencies in your diet. Now how you do all this is completely up to you. I definitely recommend talking to your doctor before you start supplementing anything but if I was to go through and try all these things I would do one at a time and I would wait maybe about two or three weeks of consistently taking that vitamin or mineral to see if my acne improved. This way I could really see which ones helped improve my acne instead of just taking them all at once and having no clue which one was the help. If you found this video useful, of course subscribe because there's tons more where that came from, but also check out my acne program, theacnemethod.com, because I'm telling you, this is just a small section within the program, and this is just filled with gold. There are so many other gold nuggets, so many gems throughout the entire program. So check out all the details on theacnemethod.com, and if you're looking for my favorite skincare brand of all time, use Banish. Brian5 will get you $5 off your first order. And with that, give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already and I'll see you guys in the very next video.